Well, tonight the search is on for a murder suspect in Pierce County after detectives say he shot a man in the face in Parkland with no provocation. It was the first local homicide of the year. Caden Lee Osley, who you see here, has a warrant for his arrest in Pierce County for murder in the first degree. Deputies say he was sitting in the car with 40 year old Surin Lay, who was talking to him about helping him get a job when Osley turned and shot Surin, who was in the back seat. According to court documents, the driver of the car then asked Osley why he shot Surin. And he replied, I thought that's what I was supposed to do. The driver told detectives Osley then pointed a gun at him, told him to take him to 102nd and Ainsworth, where he got out. Deputies found Surin dead in the red Honda in the area of South Wheeler Street and Ainsworth. Now, his loved ones are planning his funeral for next week. Surin leaves behind a large family, including a daughter. His girlfriend says they dated when they were younger, but then they reconnected five years ago. He was like my soulmate. So at the end of the day, he found his way back to me after 17 years. So we were trying to continue what we had back then. And unfortunately, that won't be able to happen anymore because he's not here. She says it's not fair that they are grieving while Caden Osley remains free. He's five feet, six inches tall, 125 pounds. Call 911 if you spot him on the street. If you know where he's staying, maybe somebody's hiding him. Submit an anonymous tip to Crime Stoppers of Tacoma Pierce County through the P3 Tips app on your cell phone. Jamie, this cat's also wanted for kidnapping and stabbing his girlfriend on November 28th. He had a warrant for his arrest. They had been looking for him, but they hadn't been able to find him. So they were he was charged in that domestic violence crime as well. Yeah, and when it comes to domestic violence, we know how quickly those situations can escalate, right? And we've also seen a huge spike in numbers during the pandemic, especially when it comes to domestic violence murders. It has been horrific, and this guy, police say, is a danger to everyone, and he's unstable, and they say he's using meth and heroin. So if you spot him, call 911 right away.